Ever had that feeling that you're going around in circles? Well, it might be because you've got a centripetal force acting upon you. And that force makes you accelerate with a centripetal acceleration, which continuously changes your direction and hence makes you go around in a circle. Now, here we have a fairground ride and, and these poor people who are being hurled around at the ends of these strings uh, are in circular motion. And they continue in circular motion because the tension in the in the cables, which are all attached to the center of the fairground ride, they're under tension and they're pulling those people inwards with a force. And that is the centripetal force, which is necessary to keep these people moving in a circle. So the centripetal force and centripetal acceleration is always directed towards the center of rotation. In the case of a satellite orbiting the Earth, the same is true. So if this is our satellite here, I'll try and make it I'll try and make it vaguely realistic with some solar cells, solar panels. Okay, it's moving in a circle around the Earth. Now, what stops it from just flying off? Well, gravity. Gravity is supplying the force inwards towards the center of its rotation. And that's the centripetal force necessary to keep this satellite in circular motion. It is possible to think of this as, if we have the circle like that, and here's our satellite, it is possible to think of it as moving in a straight line and then falling back to the Earth. Moving in a straight line and then falling back to the Earth. And so this falling back is the acceleration due to gravity, always directed towards the center of rotation. So that is the centripetal force. In another example, a car going round a roundabout. What keeps the car in a circle? Because it has a speed in a straight line forwards at one instant, but it's going to actually move in a circle. Well, it can only be friction between the tires and the, and the ground, which is acting towards the center of the circle. That force of friction is the centripetal force and that creates the centripetal acceleration that keeps the car going in a circle. So, for objects going in circles, the centripetal force and centripetal acceleration is always directed towards the center of the rotation.